any other punches. Oh, what, they are tonics. Tonic punches. What they have is a geared mechanism there that you can see. Yeah. And it's been designed to overcome all of the problems that people have when they punch card. Lots of people complain you can't get through thick card or they stick or that they jam. Yeah. These punches will go through 500 gram card. Wow. And not wow. only do they go really? through it, they go through it very easily. This is a card blank, it's 240 gram card. We're going to fold it in half and double it up. So it's 480 grams of card and a double thickness. It's just what punches don't like really. But not only will these punches punch it, they punch it very easily. I don't have to use any excessive force or any sleight of hand. These punches just go through thick card. Are you familiar with the lining up of this type of punch? Can you see yeah, yeah, the silver yeah, yeah, yeah. pattern on the base? It's the same shape as the cutout. So I slide it along and line it up. Yeah. And punch again. Slide the next one along. But because they're so easy to press down, you can put more effort into holding your card in place. A lot of punches, you've got to really struggle yeah, yeah, with yeah. them. But with these, you can easily hold it with one hand and punch it with the other. This is fantastic. And there you go, look the front and the back of the card at the same time so it lines up exactly. Now the other thing you can do with these punches that you can't do with other border punches, <laughs> you can do corners as well. Turn them upside down, they have a little door there that collects the waste for you. That door will clip out the way and stay out of your way so you can see what you're doing in there. If you take your corner then and put it into the punch, now you have to line it up by eye, but a little tip is if you look at the two legs of the punch, if you line up one edge with that leg and the other edge with that leg, it's in there at 45 degrees, so you can give it a little squeeze, and there you go, you can do corners with them as well. Now there's lots of different designs of them. Some of them are edging punches and some of them are double edging punches. If you look at these two here, they're very similar. Yeah. This one chops off one edge, but this one chops off two. So this one, you get a border that stays attached to your card like this. But this one here, it cuts off both edges as you go. So what you end up with is a little trim then that you can stick on or wrap around anything that you want to. Now you don't have to do anything different when you do the double edges. It is something that just naturally happens. You will see, as I go along, it cuts off both edges. So when I get to the end, it just separates. And how much it cost one of these? How much? They're 9.99 each, or any two for 18 pounds. And there you go, when you get to the end. You always get these little bits that you can use. And on the double edges, you always get this inverted scallop. That is a result of that curved bit there at the bottom of the punch. Mm -hmm. That gives you the ability to do some other corners. I'm always being asked for a punch that will do inverted corners. But with these, you can do it. If you put your corner into there, you can snip it off oh, to invert yeah. the corner. Like a ticket. If you want to do it a bit further, you can take it off more. So that's I just a little it's... extra that yeah. you can do with the punches. They're normally eleven ninety nine these punches, but we have them on offer at the show for nine ninety nine or two for eighteen pounds. And do you, you have a site, correct? A website. This is a website. Yes, we yeah, do. Yeah, do you I export? already bought for them. Do, yes, yes, the export. I okay. already bought for them. We we sell send quite a lot to Portugal because there's yeah. a big sort of expat community in Portugal and Spain and yeah, we send that out. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All, um, yeah I think the secret with um, sending abroad is if we need to keep it under two kilos mm -hmm. and then we yeah, can send it Royal Mail. If we send it, if it's above two kilos, we have to send it by courier, and it's which really costs cool. about sort of 18 pounds to Portugal. All the designs are in the units there. If you look on the front of the shelf. So, to do, to do this one.